hi guys welcome back to my channel so yesterday was the first day of fall fall is my favorite season and I look forward to it every year it's like the perfect mix of all the seasons I feel every time fall comes around my favorite part to do is decorate for fall usually I'm on time this time I'm a day late so I'm gonna make the most of it got my husband to bring up some of the stuff that I have the stuff that I usually put out we brought it out of the basement and I added a couple more things I'm super excited to show you guys what I will be doing the befores and afters but I have a special person helping me do this decoration let's get started it's like the perfect mix of the Sun and everything it's beautiful and right now I don't really have anything outside so I will be doing a lot of decoration out here and look who I have Hi guys, here. welcome to our channel again. This is me and my mother and today we're going to have the best channel ever. We're going to decorate for fall since it's the first day of fall. Second day today. I mean second day. <laughs> so are you excited? Yeah. Alright, let's do it. Yeah. I can't wait to do it. Guys, that's how we are going to decorate for fall. So this is going to be easy. The whole parts are going to be easy for me and my mom. We're just getting decorations for inside and outside. So we'll see you on the next day. Guys, just to let you know, these are nice. These are nice? Yeah. Did you see me put those pumpkins on the stuff? Yeah, they were fun. All right, so this was a quick one, and I know I'm still gonna end up getting some more stuff, but so far, this is how it looks. So I tried to decorate it this way. I have our little pumpkins going up for our last name, K, and then be thankful fall is here, pumpkin. I'm gonna get a new mat, and yeah. So I will be adding a little bit more like flowers and stuff, but this is up on the garage. So the outside is done. The next thing I'm going to be doing is inside the house. So changing up the table and all of that. In the living room, I'm going to change a couple things over here. As at this point when I was doing, when I made the video the other day, 
and um, I did my kitchen table this way. These are placemats that I put down, my table runner, and then this is a very pretty piece that I love having. These are candles, like, I lost, I, I'm not sure where one of these candles went, but these are the ones which are those LED. And I know I had three of them, and when I put my stuff away, I can find one of them. But I replaced that with an orange candle, but that's a regular one, which has like a pumpkin smell to it. And then just um, these cute little pumpkins. This one says, count your blessings. And then this one says, be thankful. So just in case you guys are wondering what this plastic is, I keep it to protect my table from my kids. On an everyday, regular basis, they're spilling water, they're um, putting slime down, they're doing all sorts of craziness, and um, you know, anytime I have to take this off, I can easily take it off. They'll play with toys and they'll bang the toys on there, so that's what. So if that's a very good idea if you guys are trying to protect your furniture from your kids, um, you know, if your kids, um, you know, are little. My daughter, because she's still little, and um, you know, she will once in a while have these little things which she does, and then she says, I'm so sorry, mommy, I didn't mean it. It was just an accident. And um, so for something like that, that way the kids can do whatever they want. They don't have to worry. It's so much easier for me to clean this plastic than try to fix my table. Now this is in the center of my like kitchen counter island. Like I just put this pumpkin here. Um, and then, you know, just a couple smaller pumpkins with my candles. Now going towards the living room. So this is where I left off the last time. These are my pretty little golden pumpkins. And um, I love them so much that I kind of didn't even put them away last year. So they sat here the whole time. They're almost like ceramic. And then here I have this one other pumpkin, like just the one which um, I had on the kitchen counter. And here it says thankful and peace over here. So what I did now in here is these are like extra garlands that I got and I just added this for color. Um, it's pretty pale. Hold on, I'm, I'm gonna have to move this to show you. This is how it usually looks and which is pretty on its own, but with the fall decoration, I wanted to add some more of, you know, kind of orange to it. Now, most of my stuff here is from Kirkland's. I love Kirkland's. Those pumpkin, that pumpkin, the two of those pumpkins, that thankful, this piece right here is all from Kirkland's. Um, this stuff here, so this is so super cute. Look, take a closer look at it. Each one of them have like, they're like these plastic jars and they have a pretty little something in there like leaves, orange leaves, gold leaves, um, everything fall. This garland over here I got from at home. It was $8.99 at, at home. So it was really nice. And then those smaller ones like, the thinner type of ones, these I found at the dollar store. So um, it, was, it was nice because all I needed it was just for a little bit of accent and um, that was just enough to do the job. So I got those from there. The Most of the other stuff, the rest of the stuff is all Kirkland's, including my kitchen table piece. Now these flowers, like the orangey ones, like I picked out the fly flowers from Michaels and um, I just wanted to add some more color usually. Like if it's not fall, then I take these ones out and I add, you know, I leave these ones in with a little bit of blue touch to it because my living room has um, beige and blue look. This is how I decorated my living room for fall. Feels very cozy and you know, I had to put that fireplace on. It is kind of cold today, so um, it's really nice to have that on, but I also wanted you guys to get the feel of how it would look with the lights on and it just gives the whole room a little touch of colors you know just that fall look just to have that orange and yellow tones that um, 
it's very, very beautiful. So I got my curls on today, so I have my hair up in a bun, but um, I wanted to make this quick update because I know that I was, I started doing it the other day and I left off and I'm like, I need to share this with you guys and, you know, just wanted to show you how I decorate my house for fall and how excited I get. This will go into Thanksgiving too, so I do have a piece which is like a turkey, so I might add just, you know, a piece or two to it, but other than that, this is just enough for the house to be ready for the season, but at the same time not look too cluttery and too much. I hope you guys liked this video and uh, this gave you some ideas for fall. If you're a fall lover like me, if you guys enjoyed this video and would love for me to make more videos like this, please comment down below or if you just loved how I decorated, um, please do share in the comments down below. I will see you in another one. Till then, stay happy, stay healthy, stay safe. Bye.